LUTs are a huge asset for digital filmmakers, especially anyone who's new to color grading. A LUT, which stands for lookup table, is a preset file that applies a specific color transformation to your footage, allowing you to alter the color of a clip quickly and easily. In this tutorial, I'll walk you through how to add a LUT in Premiere Pro. Before we dive in, it's important to know that there are two main types of LUTs, input LUTs and creative look LUTs. An input LUT is used to convert footage from your camera filmed in a log profile to a standard viewable color space such as Rec. 709. A creative look LUT, on the other hand, is intended to enhance the style and mood of a clip, like a 2000s teal and orange blockbuster LUT or a Matrix inspired green LUT. This type of LUT is typically applied after primary color corrections. If you're looking to use a creative LUT in your project, the Storyblocks library has an extensive collection of LUTs to help you shape your footage into nearly any desired look. In Premiere Pro, there are two ways to apply a LUT onto your clip. Let's start with the first method using the effects panel. If the effects panel isn't visible, go to Window, Effects to open it. Then navigate to Video Effects, Color Correction, Lumetri Color, and drag Lumetri Color onto your video clip. Next, open the Effects Controls panel. If this panel isn't visible, click Window, Effects Controls. You should now see the Lumetri Color effect active within the control panel. From here, open up Basic Correction. Right away, you'll see a drop-down menu for an input LUT. As I mentioned before, an input LUT converts log footage to a standard encoding profile. If you have a camera-specific LUT and need to import it, click Browse and import the LUT. Then, you can select the imported LUT from the drop-down menu. To apply a creative LUT, expand the Creative menu below and open the Look menu. Here, Premiere Pro offers a variety of built-in LUTs, but if you want to import your own creative LUT, select Browse, navigate to your downloaded file, and import the LUT. The second and more efficient method is to use the Lumetri Color panel. To access it, go to Window, Lumetri Color. The Lumetri Color panel will appear to the right, but you can easily undock and relocate it if necessary. You'll notice the parameters here are exactly the same as those when applying Lumetri as an individual effect. You can apply an input LUT or a creative LUT from this panel using the exact same sections we just covered in the effects controls panel. In my opinion, this approach is more efficient because you don't need to add the Lumetri color effect individually to each clip. You can just select a video clip, go straight to the panel, and apply the desired LUT. Additionally, you can apply LUTs to adjustment layers to affect every single clip located beneath it. If you don't know what an adjustment layer is, you can go ahead and click right up here to learn more. You're now an expert on a few methods to add LUTs to your footage in Premiere Pro. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Then head over to storyblocks.com if you're looking for a few LUTs to add to your videos, as well as royalty-free 4K footage, templates, music, and more.